If you're a fan of my content, if you're a fan of my content and I am making you hungry, consider smashing that subscribe button and clicking that notification bell. It's every Saturday, the show everyone loves to watch, Outlaws Hideout. I'm here to try the Euro House Nachos. Look at that, close up. What does everyone think of that? Thumbnail this. There's our thumbnail. All right, let's the show you what outlaw is. the Euro house. Yeah. It's his sticky sauce right here. There's feta. Looks like lamb or beef and pita chips. And I got a fork for these nachos. All right. I can't so wait I'm to put this tzatziki sauce on here. Oh yeah, it's tzatziki sauce. All right, here we go. Whoa, boom, boom. You gotta have it for your nachos. Otherwise, it's not Euro. I guess call this Euro nachos, I guess. <laughs> so it's pita chips right here. But here's one. Let's give this one a try. Dip it in the tzatziki sauce. Mm, not bad of a creation. This is about this was about $10.99 at the Euro House. Here, you guys can try another one. Here, here you go. What do you guys think of that? Wow, got very tender. It's not tough. You got the cre creamy tzatziki sauce. These pita chips right here. Kind of hard and a little crunchy too. I can see they probably fried it. Here we go, another one with the tzatziki sauce. Mm. Well, the vegetables are pretty good with this. They're not that bad. The feta cheese. Wow, actually, believe it or not, the feta, feta cheese is also creamy as well. Here's another one. Wow, that is good. And then you're missing in here are the fries. <laughs> kind of creative of them to do something like this. I really just wanted to review this. I tried getting this on DoorDash they don't have the, they only have euros and that's it. They even sell burgers there. They don't have burgers at all on the app. So I had to, I went to a Euro house, you know, just for lunch. And I saw, oh, you have your nachos. Yes, let's review this. So I always wanted to review their Euro now. I always wanted to review their nachos at the Euro house. But it was packed in there. So many people in there and I couldn't film. And there's like, they're playing like, whoa, a prayer. I'm not going to play that song because I'll probably get a copyright for that. Here you go, another one. And it's just so creative. Um, I like the creativity of what they did on this, you know, with the presentation with the pita chips, the lamb and beef, as well as the feta cheese. And then you put the tzatziki sauce in there. If you didn't have that in there, I don't know if this would do good. I think it would go more well if they put more vegetables on here. I mean, you have some tomatoes on there. And you got your onions. Maybe spice it up. I'm a spice head, like I say. I like spicy foods. Maybe more feta cheese would go well in here. I 
And I don't think they have, I don't think they have enough feta cheese in here. One more bite, we'll get to our rating. I need more vegetables and more feta cheese on here. One more with this generating because I have the feta on here this time. All right, here we go. Here we go. There's the feta right there. A little more feta would go well with this. A little more feta and more vegetables. Maybe like jalapenos or banana peppers. So now let's rating for the Euro House nachos. I'm gonna this season well too. I'm gonna give this, let's give it a 4.6 out of five. It's really good. I just think what I would recommend is it has more vegetables on here. 10.99 is not a bad price for that. And I think it needs a little more feta cheese will go well. Just, but all in all, 4.6 is pretty good for out of five for Euro House. So Outlaws, you're at the Euro House. Go there and tell them Mike Outlaw told you you should try to review their nachos because these are really good. All right, so at the end of this video, I'm gonna recommend some good content for you. Roll the credits. From Chicago Pizza Deep Dish, click the round subscribe button to Jobbers or Us. Click the round subscribe on Atlas Generation and you can check out my patreon.com slash outlast generation that's it for the review you can't review it until you taste it until next time join us outlaw cowboys next food adventure outlaws outlaws generation out